Former President Jimmy Carter has entered home hospice care in Georgia. And people across the country are reflecting on his legacy. Fox's Caroline Shively joining us live from the nation's capital with our update tonight. Good evening, Natalie and Anthony. Family and supporters are paying tribute to former President Jimmy Carter as he receives hospice care at home. He's lived such a good and valuable and important life. Uh, that has affected hey, so many people. No people in former President Jimmy Carter's home state of Georgia reflecting on his life and legacy Sunday. Carter is resting in his house in Plains after choosing to no longer seek life-prolonging medical treatment. Before his time in Washington, the former peanut farmer served as the governor of Georgia and as a Georgia state senator, a fixture in the community. It was so natural for him to do that, that it was not a surprise, and, and people took it for granted. This is what Jimmy does. You know, he lives there, he works there. President Biden also offered his well wishes on Sunday, tweeting, Jill and I are with you in prayer and love. We admire you for the strength and humility you have shown in difficult times. Carter was elected the 39th president in 1976. It was a critical time in U.S. history in the wake of the Vietnam War and the Watergate scandal, which forced then-President Nixon out of office two years earlier. Though many say Carter's decades of charity work are his greatest contribution. The former Navy uh, serviceman uh, who came into office as a stable force, calming force in our country's life. He remained, I think, now the model for what someone does post-presidency in America. The former president celebrated his 98th birthday in October with his family, now by his side. Reporting live in Washington, I'm Caroline Shively, Fox 32, Chicago.